is in collaboration with Pretty Little Thing so thank you so much to Pretty Little Thing for letting me go on the website and pick out a brand new autumn wardrobe. I'm so excited to see the bits that I actually picked, try them on and hopefully fingers crossed they will all fit and I will keep them all and um, yeah just be completely prepared for autumn so yeah this is in collaboration with Pretty Little Thing it's not a paid video um, but they have been kind enough to let me pick out all these things so thank you very much Pretty Little Thing um, and yeah this is just a Pretty Little Thing haul I've picked out tons of things that are quite transitional perfect to wear like now dead good for layering and I'm just going to share them with you try them on let you know what I think of them tell you what I think about fit if you don't already, go and follow me on Instagram. My handle is just here. I will be sharing all of these outfits, how I style them, put them together on there over the next few weeks. And yeah, let's just get straight into the haul because I have tons to show you. All the links for everything will be in the description. Let me know which ones you like, what you don't like, what you're going to buy yourself, all that kind of stuff. And we can have a great big chat about everything that's in here, autumn fashion and what we plan on wearing over the next few weeks. So let's get straight into it. Okay, so as you can see, I have a lot of bags. I have opened them up to peek through because I literally couldn't even remember what I'd ordered. So, I'm just going to pull it all out and oh, get started. Let's sit right back and get comfy because this could be a while. <laughs> okay, so first thing. Oh, I've actually wore this because I needed a jumper to wear yesterday. So I have worn this one, but everything else I haven't. So I got this little jumper, which I'm absolutely loving. So it is a cream oversized knit. It has all this like distressed edging on the hems, on the sleeves on the bottom and it is like a real boxy boxy oversized fit and it has a V neck front. I got it in a size large because I wanted it to be big but quite honestly it's too big. I really should have got like a small I think would have been fine because it's oversized and boxy anyway and when I've been putting it on it's quite like revealing here which isn't really my vibe. So I kind of wish I got it in a small but or even a medium but saying that I do absolutely love it I think it'll look really nice layered over like a shirt dress or even just like a big white shirt as well because it's got the v-neck I think it'll look really cool with that and it's just really really nice it feels nice and thick the the cut on it is dead dead nice it's boxy it's really boxy and yeah I love it so I'm gonna try everything on so you can see exactly how it's like what it's like on the fit and all that kind of jazz as well um, but yeah this was a good buy all the all the links will be in the description box so you can just click through the links find the prices and all those things pretty little thing always have like codes and offers and that kind of stuff on as well so yeah I like this one I got it in a size large and it's just really really cute it would look really nice as well with like black leather pants like this over a nice little skirt and boots or laid over a nice little day dress for like a bit of a casual vibe um, but yeah, you could also like dress it up and have it like a bit off your shoulder. Maybe some like layered gold jewellery or something like that would look really cool. But yeah, really, really nice, nice quality. So that one was fab. <laughs> I really like that. I just wish I'd got it in a smaller size. That is all. Okay, so the next thing in here I'm really excited about. So I saw this jacket on the website and it really reminded me of the Zara one that... that they did last year um, so I ordered it it's a bit out there and I was gonna get like the black because I think they do it in black as well or they definitely do it in a darker color I can't remember which one it was now but I thought do you know what no I'm gonna be a bit braver a bit like go with some different colors so I went for this little red one and it is so so nice it's a proper like thick padded and it's like a it's like a high shine Vinyl, and it's just a really cute little cropped kind of 
bomber like padded little jacket so yeah I really really like it it feels like really sturdy so I think it's gonna have loads of shape to it and keep its structure and I'm planning on wearing it like with joggers and trainers and really casual I'll probably wear it on Sunday when I take the boys to football but when it's a little bit colder or I might even just wear it just with black just to tone it down a little bit it might look cute as well with like an oversized hoodie underneath really really casual um but yeah i'm absolutely loving that i can't wait to try it on so i got it in a size eight and it looks a nice nice fit so yeah that was another one that i got which i absolutely loved i can't wait to try that on there's that one okay and then i picked up this which is just a really basic baseball cap because i really like just a cap at the moment um, when my hair is just a mess and I can't be bothered to do anything with it or when I'm being really lazy I'm getting on a little bit like I'm 30 I'm actually 35 next week I have some grey hairs coming sometimes in between getting to the salon and getting my roots done I have some grey hairs that show my hair and a cap is my best friend on those days <laughs> so I've been wearing that like caps quite a lot when I can't be bothered to do my hair and stuff like that so I liked this one, I thought it was kind of like Yeezy vibes and it's like a grey, like a washed grey charcoal -y colour and then it's just got like a velcro back and I just picked it up because I thought this time of year I love just like my casual outfits a lot are like hoodies, jackets, like quite casual joggers and I just thought that's something that I can just team with those kind of things so I'm dead dead happy with that, it's really really cute on and what we have next see this is where i'm getting to the point where i can't even remember what i ordered oh yeah so these trousers i ordered because i just thought they i really like i've not really got anything at the minute it's like i've got like dressy like leathery pants jeans but i haven't really got any trousers at the moment like if i'm going out or if i'm going to like a work meeting or i want to dress up that i can put on with a nice pair of flats uh and dress up or down and i saw these on the website and i thought you know what these are quite cute i'm not sure how they're going to look on whether the pleat is going to be a little bit unflattering i'm not quite sure the material is a little bit like more like a jersey stretchy kind of material where I did think it'd be much more of a like kind of tailored kind of fit um but these are maybe a bit more casual but we will try them on and see I love the colour on them the camel is really nice the waistband feels really nice and stretchy and the material is soft it's just not like a tailored one so maybe like a good option for like a cheaper workwear um but I feel like these might be one that just surprise you and look amazing on so I got a size 8 in those because um, I don't want them too big. They may also look really nice just rolled up at the bottom if they're a little bit too long. If I want to wear them with flats or something, they may look cute like that. So I'm going to try them on and have a little look. But yeah, they are cute. Very, very cute. And then I picked up this jumper. Um, again, like in autumn, casual time, I just want to be comfy. I wear a lot of hoodies and I thought this was a bit different so rather than like going for a normal like white hoodie which I do all the time I thought I'd try something a bit different so I picked this up and I wasn't quite sure on the collar to be honest because it's like this funny collar here with the zip but I thought I'm going to try it try something different but now it's come I do actually really like it I think it's going to look cute I got it in a size large because I wanted it to be a little bit bigger, bigger and boxier fit and it has like this stretchy like hem around the bottom so I'm thinking it'll be easy just to kind of tuck it under and have it really nice oversized boxy um, and then the sleeves will be nice and big because there's nothing worse than a sweatshirt that isn't quite big enough in my opinion um, so yeah I really like that and that's going to look so so cute on so yeah I've got this just to wear with like ripped jeans, trainers, joggers full on like weekend casual running around with the kids really really cute but then saying that the, the way the weather's been at the moment like it's really sunny there is not a cloud in the sky today it's a beautiful day so this might look really nice with like denim shorts and trainers as well so real nice like transitional piece so yeah I got a size large and 
it's a, definitely a winner that one I can tell just by looking at it I'm gonna get loads of wear out of that okay what else is in this bag some accessories I always love pretty little thing accessories they always seem to have something that's like a bit different and a bit quirky um, so I can't even remember what I ordered let's go for these first oh yeah I like these earrings so these are quite a statement earring and it's not very often that I wear an earring but when I do and I go out I want to and I'm going to wear an earring it's always something quite a statement so I picked up these because I saw them on the website and I just thought they would look really really cute like quite often I'll wear just like um like a white oversized shirt like a pair of heels a nice little skirt or something like that and I just thought they'd look really cute with that just to dress them up I will only wear them at night because they're just not me for in the day I'm just not a big earring person but yeah they're cute they're called door knocker hoops they literally look like a door knocker but yeah they just got like this red rib design and really nice and big and oversized so yeah I'm loving those and then I picked up two necklaces I can't remember what they are now though what was this one? I can't remember oh they've sent me the wrong one. Oh, I wanted unless I, I maybe I've ordered the wrong one I wanted the little they do these little star sign necklaces and I wanted the one that said Libra but this says Taurus so maybe I've ordered the wrong size I must have ordered the wrong one what an idiot I'm gonna to have to find someone who's a Taurus <laughs> to give this to so if you're a Taurus comment below or send me a DM on Instagram and I can pop it to you but yeah I'm gonna order the right one I've obviously just ordered the wrong one but I wanted this in Libra um, because I just thought it was really really cute and I got my other Libra necklace which is from Betty and Biddy which people always ask me about and I wear it all the time I love it so I thought if I get one of those it'll go really nicely together so yeah I'm gonna have to reorder that because that's it says Taurus but you get the gist how cute are those I love those um some of them were like had diamante and some were just plain as well so you can choose which you want and then this one what's in this one there's another little necklace what was it on can't even get it out oh yeah it was like a little cherub I think that's what you call it is it like a little cherub is that what you call it like a little angely thing so it's like a little cherub angel and I just thought it was so cute and I love necklaces like this I wear stuff like this all the time just layered up and I'd not seen one like that before so I picked that up because I thought it was so so cute so that I love and then I also picked up another western style belt again actually pretty little thing always do some amazing accessories and belts and I just feel like you can never go wrong with a belt I wear belts pretty much with every outfit not today but pretty much with every outfit so it's just this western western style belt and I have got one like this but this had all like the detailing on the um, size which I really really like and I loved that the um, the buckle was like really detailed and yeah I love that so I picked up that little belt which I'm sure you will see me teaming with loads of shorts like now over the next few weeks before it gets too cold and sweatshirts and knits and boots and stuff like that and then like jeans and stuff too so yeah that was really cute and I got size small medium in that because I mostly just wear belts around my waist so that was that one and then I picked up some shoes um, because obviously we are going into autumn uh, a lot of my heels for like going out or if I'm dressing up are more summery uh, so I wanted a pair of heeled boots and I saw these on the Pretty Little Thing website and I was like, oh my God, these are just perfect. How amazing are these? So they're like this chunky flared heel and then they have a square toe and they're this like high shine patent vinyl um, boot with like a side zip and I just love them. Oh my God, yes, how good are they? So I just thought they are gonna look so sick with like even like a light coloured jean now 
and then like black jeans and leggings and or even little like dresses and skirts and stuff they're gonna look so cute I can definitely like dress these up or down and they just feel so nice they feel so so nice the quality on them feels so good so yeah I picked up those I'm a size six and pretty little thing generally like the sizing spot on their footwear so I got those they are amazing I love those let me know in the comments if you love these I'm a big big fan of these Yes, so I got those to go with lots of like my autumny, wintry outfits. And then, oh, I have another accessory. So I picked up this belt, and the reason I picked up this belt actually was because I see Emily Shack in her, I think she has uh, the Vivian, Vivian Westwood um, kind of style of this belt and I see her in it all the time and I saw this on the website I was like oh I love that it's so nice um, so I've worn it a couple of times already I wore it the other night it just looped over um, I've got like an oversized knitted cardigan from Revolve and I wore it like around the middle and it looked so so good you can also like kind of tuck it under rather than doing it um, through the loop so it kind of sits like that and that looks really really nice um, yeah, and I just loved it. So that again, I got in a size small medium and it's been a perfect fit on me for around my waist. I feel like Effie's going to pinch this though because it's very small. <laughs> so I got that belt too. And then, oh, I picked up this loungewear. I love knitted loungewear for this time of year and I've had these sets before, but I saw this colour and I was like, I need this colour. I ordered it in a size large because I wanted it really, really big. So if you have followed me for a while on Instagram and stuff, you would have seen that I wore like the camely tan colour, one of this, towards the beginning of the year. And I absolutely loved it, just like layered under coats for like casual like shopping days for just chilling around out at home. Um, it's really nice for like airport outfit and traveling and things like that. But this colour I just thought was so, so nice. It's so out there um, and I just thought it'd look really cute. So I plan to wear this just with like Air Force Ones, this and then like I've got a light coloured top shop uh, oversized kind of denim jacket. I thought that would look really cute. Um, so yeah, I got a size large because I wanted it big, like really big. <laughs> So they are quite big but I wanted them oversized and then the top is like a slash neck, sweatshirty kind of, sweatshirt kind of fit knitted jumper then it has this slash neck so you can kind of wear it like off the shoulder or, <clears throat> or just like as a kind of round neck, uh, slash neck so it's just wear it high and then I really like on these that the cuffs are like really nice and long and the same on the pants as well so yeah I've had these before and I've worn them loads and loads so I loved that colour they've got these in tons and tons of colour so I'll link them below and you can have a little look but I would say if you don't want um if you don't want it oversized just go for your no normal size in them because these are really really big on me but I did want them I was like inspired by the um I think it was I'm not sure if it was Sophia Ritchie I think it was Sophia Ritchie and she had like a little green tracksuit on with a little dog and I was like oh my god that's the cutest so that was my kind of thinking behind that I will find the little outfit and pop it up so you can see and then what have we got in here next thing I got was this little dress now I always think September and beginning of October is dress bare leg and boots weather it is like my thing that I wear loads this time of year so I've been buying quite a lot of little shirt dresses, day dresses, and things like that. And I saw this and I was like, love this. I have had it out and looked at it because I couldn't resist. But it is this little green, like a khaki green shirt dress, day dress kind of thing. But it doesn't have a collar, which I'm quite happy about because I'm not the biggest fan of like a big like collar. Um, it just has this round neck and then it has buttons all the way down that I'm done at the moment because I haven't done it did it because I couldn't resist trying it on and then it has this kind of like corsety effect through the middle and then it's like puffed out I thought it looked really nice with the belt really nice with boots and then the sleeves are like a puffy oversized fit with like a little collar uh, little cuff um, just to bring it in at the wrist and oh my god it looks so nice on I absolutely love it 
um, and the colour is very autumnal and I just absolutely love this. So I plan to wear this, just bare legs, belted probably with this belt and then like some black boots in the daytime um, and oh it's just so so cute but you could definitely dress that up as well for evening with some heels and make it a lot more glam but yeah I love it. I got it in a size, what size did I get? Oh, I got it in a size 10 because sometimes with a shirt dress, I don't want it to be too fitted. I want it to be baggy, but I'm not sure whether it is going to be a bit too baggy, but we will see. Hopefully, because it's got like the corsety bit, um, it will be fine. And it also, if we belt it up, if it is a little bit long, it will be absolutely fine. So yeah, it feels really nice. The quality feels really, really nice on that. It feels like nice and thick. It's not like a thin shirt dress. It'll be like unflattering. This is like much more like structured and a nice fit. And look, the... the sleeves are so puffy and cute so it would look really nice as well if you did want to dress it up with like gold accessories would look really really nice so big big fan of that so that was one other thing that I got so this is a really cute little knitted jumper and oh where is it here we go yeah so how cute is this I saw this and I was like I love it I love a colour block jumper in, in the winter, just for like really nice with denim. So my plan is just to wear this with mum jeans, kind of tucked in, nice belt, trainers. Oh, just so, so snuggly, all the snuggly vibes. I got it in a size medium, because I didn't want it to be too small. I wanted it to be big and boxy, but this feels so soft. It's like a real nice fluffy, soft knit. It's just got this high neck. So yeah, it's cream on the middle and then the sleeve, one side is pink and it's like a um, balloon, like oversized sleeve and then the other side is like this tan brown colour and just how cute does it look together. I love it. I'm 100% going to wear this tomorrow. I love it. It would look really nice with denim shorts now. I love this time of year where you can still get your legs out or you can wear a little skirt and just a nice little knit or cardi over the top. I just think it's such a nice time of year. And yeah, that is definitely gonna get worn. This is gonna be one of my favorite jumpers of the year, I can tell. So yeah, that's really nice. I'm really, really happy with that. It's so, so lovely. So yeah, size medium, super soft, super boxy. And yeah, that one is definitely a winner. I feel like you girls need this. Let me know in the comments if you love this jumper too because I feel like everybody needs this knitted jumper. How cute is that? And then another thing, I'm always banging on about this Sasha green colour, but here it is again. I'm telling you, it's the colour of autumn. I saw this trench coat and I've already bought a trench coat. Or In fact, I've already bought two trench coats this, this year already. And it's not even October yet, so yeah. That is not good. I bought two trench coats. I bought like a camely colour one and I bought a black painted one from Topshop. So really I shouldn't have bought this, but it is different and that's what I was thinking to myself. It's quite, quite different. So it's this amazing trench coat, but it is in the colour of the season, which is this like pistachio green colour and trench coats, you just can't go wrong. You can dress them up. You can wear them to work, you can wear them dressy, you can wear them out to dinner with your husband, you can wear them casual with joggers and a hoodie and trainers, you just cannot go wrong. So I absolutely love this and I know I'm going to get my wear out of it, it's just got a tie waist, the sleeves have got loads of details, so it's got like the little button on the cuff, so it looks nice and expensive because it's got the little trims on the shoulders and it's got nice buttons and yeah it feels really really nice so I'm dead happy with that. I got it in a size 8 because I think with a trench coat they're usually quite big anyway. Don't want it too big because it'll start making me look a bit short and stumpy. So yeah, that is amazing. I love it. It might look like a grey colour on camera maybe but it is like a pistachio green. So it says pale khaki but I say it's pistachio. So yeah, oh, you're going to see a lot of this coat I'm telling you it now. That is a winner. Definitely. Okay, what else do we have? We still have some bags. Okay, what can we remember what these are? Oh, these are some jeans that I got. So I've been looking for like a really nice wide leg pair of jeans for a while now. Um, kind of more dressy for evening time and then daytime. I've got a couple of wide legs for daytime, um, but I wanted a pair that I could put with some heels and dress up with a nice little fitted like 
um, you know, like one of the corsety kind of body shirt vibey tops. And I saw these and I was like, yes, because they're a nice dark denim, so they're really nice to go into autumn, winter. And then I thought with this belt, it's really nice to just like cinch in the waist. And then these legs are going to, these oversized wide leg jeans are going to be so flattering because the waist is going to be cinched in. And then these are just going to skim over my hips. They're going to go right down to the floor. I'm going to wear heels. I'm going to look tall. I feel like they're just going to be a super flattering, super flattering jean. So... Also, you can take this belt off. Yes, you can. You can take that belt off, so put it with another belt, make it a little bit more your own. But yeah, those are a winner. I love those. I got them in a size eight because quite often with oversized jeans, they're big anyway, so I didn't want them to be like ridiculous and look like bowing Avril Lavigne, like a skateboard or something. Um, so yeah, I can't wait to try these on. So yeah, like I said, I'm gonna wear my heels, I'm gonna fully dress them up, and they are amazing. Yes. I'm so happy with those. Let me know if you love these jeans too. Leave me a little comment or if you hate them, let me know you hate them and you think I've got awful style. I got this jacket as well and I've already worn it, it's so, so nice. So it's a checked, like, duster kind of jacket. The price on it is so good, I think it's £40. Um, and I absolutely love it. I've worn it already over like a white sweatshirt, denim shorts. I've worn it over like a little skirt and a white knit. I feel like it's just going to go with so, so much and it's just so nice. So it's like a tan check. It's a really nice soft kind of uh, wool kind of feel and then it's just lined inside of this lining. I got a size, got a size eight and it is oversized and it's massive on me. So you don't need to size up, just go for your normal size on this and it's got like a double lapel collar so it's really nice and casual and yeah it's just so so nice I love it it reminds me of like a blanket coat remember when they were all in fashion um it's that kind of vibe it's just comfy you can just chuck it on and it'll go with loads of things you can dress it up or down and so so nice so yeah I did get that and I've already worn that so definitely definitely worn it and for the price so so good it's not like the warmest of coats, but that's quite good for this time of year. And then you can just layer it up with like a scarf and knits. So if you do follow me on Instagram, you will have seen this already. Um, I wore these, I got these leggings because I really wanted a nude pair of leggings. Um, I've got quite a few like nude teddy coats and like sandy colour coats that I really want for winter, like some nude leggings to wear with like my Yeezys, like my cream trainers, my Balenciagas, and just do like a whole kind of cute nude vibes. So I saw these on a pretty little thing, got them, and they weren't actually what I wanted. So it's my own fault, I didn't read the description properly. I basically wanted like a really nice, thin, tight-fitting jersey legging, and these are like a crepe straight leg trouser. So because they're like a crepe, they're not like a fit like a jersey leg might, or just completely like stick to you. They're more fitted, so the legs were slightly too straight, they weren't as fitted as I wanted them on the bottoms, and they're more like a trouser because they're thicker than like in this crepe material. But they are, are cute, they look, did look really nice on with the coat. Um, they're nude and then they've got like this white panel down the side, like a track kind of stripe down the side. Uh, really high waisted and just yeah they're just like a really nice straight fit legging so they were a nice cheap and cheerful little buy but I am going to go back on the Pretty Little Thing website because they do have some proper jersey ones and reorder what I actually wanted. So that was those. And then the last two things I've got to show you are two coats. So this I am so excited about. Everybody knows I love an uh, aviator coat and I saw this and I thought this is perfect. It's So it is another <laughs> aviator Borg jacket which is just the jacket that like everyone's still wearing this year even though everyone's been wearing them for years but this I thought was just like a little bit of a move on and a little bit more edgy so I've gone for this one as well so it's just in this black and it has white trim so it's completely lined with this white faux fur so it's going to be so warm so snug but the fit on it is slightly more boxy and it's got like a boxier like cropped shape and then the pockets obviously with the exposed kind of faux fur on the front and then these cuffs I really liked so they're like a real like exaggerated oversized cuff with a little buckle detail and oh yeah I just really really like it so I'm gonna wear like the outfit I'm wearing today like leather leggings black knits 
but I think it would also look really cute with like some blue denim and like trainers and just dress it up or down it also look really cute dressed up it look really nice over like a little dress or a little skirt and boots combo would be really really nice so yeah I absolutely love that I got that in a size 8 and it's so nice oh and so soft but I did make the mistake of putting my arm in before to test out how soft it was and all the white is like come off on my jumper so be aware so that is that one I love that and then the final thing I feel like this is still an essential to buy oh this year so if you haven't already got one of these jackets I'm telling you now get on the pretty little thing website and order yourself this jacket if there's any jacket that you're going to wear and get the most wear out of again this year probably next year this is the jacket I have like three versions of this jacket from three different places I absolutely love it I'm still gonna wear it this year I've it's a jacket that I've worn most than any other jacket in years so if you're on a budget if you haven't got like a load of budget to spend on lots of different coats all winter get yourself this you can style it so many different ways you can wear it with joggers you can wear it over hoodies you can wear it dressy with like jeans and heels you can wear it over dresses uh, it just goes with everything and it looks so so nice so it's just like a it kind of looks like leather from far away but it's not it's like a really soft thick kind of leather look material I don't know how to describe it I don't know what it is it's kind of got like a crackled effect to it but it's not anything like leather it's completely like soft and the faux fur in it is the whole way through all the way down the sleeves it is one of the warmest coats I have ever worn so yeah it is amazing it just has the belt around the bottom the details on the sleeves and just an amazing fit. I would say it's a size up because I feel like these look way better bigger. Um, so this is a size 10 and yeah, jacket of the season still goes with everything. Wear it for work, wear it at home, wear it at nights out, wear it just chilling, wear it walking the dog. You can dress it up or down, it always looks amazing. So yes, if you haven't already got one of these 88 coats, what are you doing? Get on and buy one, they are amazing. So I'll link all that below. And that concludes this pretty little thing haul. So I hope you've enjoyed watching it. I hope you've enjoyed all me sharing with you all my picks of things that I chose. All the links for everything are in the description. Um, make sure you comment, let me know which things you liked, which choices of mine you didn't like, which things you're gonna buy, which you think I should keep, which you think I should send back and yeah they're just I feel like I'm so excited now for autumn winter styling and the weather today is absolutely beautiful I've been in this today I've walked back from the kids school with them for like 40 minutes and oh my god I was dying so I can't wait to wear all these but I feel like the weather needs to change we are still in a bit of a summery kind of weather so but it will be coming it will be coming so yeah I hope you enjoyed this haul Thank you so much for watching if you did enjoy it please give me a little thumbs up don't forget to leave me comments i love hearing from you let's have a little chat and i will see you in my next video if you are not already subscribed get subscribing do not want to miss all the vlogs and hauls that i have coming up and make sure you hit that bell so you get notified every time i upload a new video so i love you all girls and i will see you in my next video bye bye